Hello there guys and gals, the Welsh Hunter here, back with yet another 100% achievement and trophy guide and this time we are grabbing everything in catch, or cat k or cat t c h Anyway, <laughs> this is a fun yet challenging platformer that usually would have taken around 4-5 to five hours to complete with a lot of swearing and saying, ah, screw this, before you calm down and go back to it anyway. Uh, <laughs> but thanks to developers Infected Pixel Studios and publishers Chili Dog Interactive, they inputted a cheat code which you can use on all 50 levels to complete every level completely 100%, therefore unlocking every achievement without having to do much in the process. Now this is going to cost you around £8.39, but is it worth it for yet another quick and unexpectedly easy 1,000 out of 1,000 or platinum trophy? Of course it is! Woohoo! So, now, as frustrating as it can be, the game is actually rather good, so I do advise, you know, just give it a go, have a bash, enjoy it. If not, and you'd rather just smash out the achievements straight away, then that is all fine and dandy too. So let's begin then, shall we? So we are actually going to be playing the first level, just to have a feel for it. Um, but basically, what the achievements are, we need to collect 500 stars. You know, you get, it's 50, 100, 200, up to 500 stars. Free all ball friends. And as a male, freeing the balls now and again is a wonderful feeling. Uh, but we have to free 100 balls, which is a lot of ball freeing. Plus, we got to grab up to 30 stickers, dying 9 times, and completing every world. Which is why I said, when you input the cheat code, it completes the, the level 100%. Therefore, you don't have to do anything, you don't have to do much, you don't have to go on your jolly extra way. But this part is important, so, listen up. Do not input the code straight away as soon as you begin a level. Do not. Do it because if you do that the achievements either stop tracking they don't unlock at all unless you quit out completely of the game and go back in and even then it still sometimes won't unlock and it could cause the game to freeze too now if it does freeze and you have to quit out the game puts you back a whole heap of levels so i highly advise to move about first grab a few stars or collectibles or whatever for everything to unlock in order so, start up a level, go ahead, run around like I said, grab a star or two, and a little ball. <laughs> that means two things. Then input the code, and doing this allows the game to recognise you are there, thus unlocking all achievements and trophies in a good order without pissing about. Now, I would do this from level 1 as soon as you begin, because if you do input the code immediately, you won't unlock the completing world 1, 2 and 3 achievements. At least it didn't unlock for me at all. No matter how many times I went through it, they wouldn't unlock. So, as soon as I took my time, collected a star or two, made sure the game recognises I was there, then I inputted the code and all achievements unlocked for me as they were supposed to. So hopefully, if you do it that way, it should unlock for you the exact same way. Tidy, no messing about, no being annoyed because all achievements are not unlocking in an order and you have to keep quitting, restarting, getting back into the game because that... It's just a pain in the ass. Yes, you can do that, and you can complete the game within 30 to 40 minutes, but if not all achievements are unlocking, then what is the point? And this is where then, by the time I took my time, I was able to get completed World 1 achievement to unlock for me, no problem. So it may it's going to take you around an hour, maybe an hour and ten, something like that, you know, if you... Like I said, take your time and grab a star or two first, then input the code. I've said that about a thousand billion times already in this video. But, you know, just in case, got to get it into your head. But, like I said, you do that, it is going to take around an hour, an hour and ten, which, hey, still, you can't beat bloody good-looking easiness, really, can you? But what I am going to do now is basically just show you the last level of when I unlock the wonderful world 2 and completing world 3 um, just again just to show you that it does actually work the way I done it again without pissing about too much which is always nice so but that's it so thank you very very much for watching guys and gals I do hope this video will help you get another easy thousand and another easy platinum again like I said without too much pissing about
I'm even doing my own editing with that. But, <laughs> like I said, thanks so much for watching, guys and gals. Big shout out to all my Patreon supporters, especially TimG84. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check me out on all my socials, Twitter, Instagram, and, of course, Patreon. All links provided in the description below. I'll see you in the next one, guys and gals. Big love.